Good day Tarot viewers, welcome to our Timeless Oracle reading and our card for today belongs to the Archangel Oracle cards and it is entitled Counselor. Okay, some of us are called to be light workers, called to be inspirers of people, called to be fellow travelers of people who are also struggling in their journey in life and it is our experiences and our inspirations that comes from the inner world or from our from the universe and from our, from our spirit guides that we are able to share in order to help others find their way sometimes even just our presence our uh, willingness to listen is already a big help for other people and uh, there's a big responsibility in being a counselor but as this picture shows we are not alone, especially when we undergo the ministry of being a counselor. We have our angels blessing us and our the divine also blessing us. You see here an angel holding the shoulders of this person who is kneeling down. Uh, the image of a person kneeling down for me symbolizes humility. There is an important need for a counselor to constantly be humble enough to accept that they don't know everything. And the reason why they know this experience uh, and also the reason why they are able to guide people is because they also underwent the struggles that these people have are experiencing at this present time. So they cannot be proud also because they too have undergone similar experiences along the way. And at the same time, yeah, the best counselors are those who are humble. So the kneeling for me, uh, the image of a kneeling person is very important. As, uh, is a very important element of being a counselor. Also, the presence of the angel touching the shoulder of this person is another important element. A counselor always needs the guidance from the spirit, from God, from the universe, from our angel, angels, and from our guides. There's always, it's we are just the medium, and the guidance really comes from the divine, from the universe. Always remember that we are just the instruments and we cannot attribute to ourselves what good things are happening in the people that we journey with. The good things that happen to them is a gift from the divine and it is not something that we should, not, should appropriate to ourselves. We should always remember that we are just servants, we are just the instruments and it is actually the divine who is guiding them. There's, so there's always this need to be humble and always be this need to being receptive and allowing ourselves to be vessels of guidance. Uh, we are just the instruments and hopefully through humility we will become effective counselors and also this constant uh, openness to the guidance of the spirit world. Okay, so now let us read uh, a little from the handbook that accompanies this one so that we can get more insights regarding counselor you according to archangel azrael you're a natural counselor and many people benefit from your guidance and reassurance additional message your life purpose involves counseling people in ways that uplift motivate comfort heal and inspire you you are a true spiritual counselor and people find you to be a trustworthy confidant expand your counseling work to the next level because you are about to help greater numbers of people call upon me for guidance and support now working with archangel azrael azrael's name means whom god helped and he helps those who are helpers. His particular interest in helping counselors, <clears throat> he's particularly interested in helping counselors who work with the grieving or dying. Ask Azrael to guide your words and actions during counseling sessions, and he'll help you remain patient and compassionate. He can also help you enter the counseling profession and guide you toward schooling internships and a wonderful counseling practice 
Okay, so that's it for now. So for those who are counselors, our angel guide is Archangel Azrael, and he will help us in our ministry. Yes, it's very important. A counselor requires a lot of patience and a lot of grace from the divine so that we will be able to effectively fulfill the ministry we are called to perform. Until next time, have a great day.